Hi peeps, my name is Zena and I'm Aging Ethically. I think it's safe to say that the world is going through some major changes right now. There's a lot going on. There is a lot of sadness. There's a lot of negativity. And if just hearing the news of the day makes you well up in tears, well, you know, just know that that's kind of normal for what's happening right now. Throughout history in uncertain times such as these, there's always been an awakening that follows, a healing, if you will. And I think that we are on the verge of a global awakening. You've seen a lot of negativity, you've seen a lot of violence, you've seen a lot of hatred, but I have also never seen so much compassion and empathy for, for human rights as I have witnessed in the last few weeks and in the last few months through this pandemic that we're experiencing. Man, I'm really painting a bleak picture here, <laughs> but it is Pride Month, you guys. And today of all days, there was a little flicker speck of hope for humanity or for human rights. Today, the Supreme Court has ruled that people cannot be fired for being gay or transgender. That is a huge, huge deal to people in the LGBTQ plus community. And it is something that really deserves celebration. I'm going to do a glam pride look today. All of the cosmetics that I will be using today are vegan and cruelty free. I'm going to list them all down below. I am an ally of the LGBTQ plus community. I have been my entire life and I will continue to be. So if you want to see me go from this to this, then stick around. This is my completed pride look for 2020. I feel pretty, I feel vibrant, I feel colorful, I feel alive. Listen guys, these are really weird times. And then adding on to that, it's an election year. So huh, we did see a landmark ruling today with the Supreme Court. But you guys, we need to register and vote this year. It's so important. Four years ago, a lot of people stayed home and didn't vote. And again, I'm not going to sway you to vote one way or another, but please do vote. I would highly encourage you to do a mail-in ballot this year because we are still in the midst of a pandemic. So don't risk your health. Go online, register to vote by mail. Send those ballots in, you guys. Just, just vote please vote please please <laughs> try not to fight with your friends family and co-workers i used to get into heated political discussions on facebook with complete strangers and it would just go you know round and around next thing you know you've wasted your entire day arguing with someone that you don't even know um but you know i know it's disappointing we're not always going to see eye to eye with our loved ones and it can hurt it can hurt very deeply you may hear some pretty shocking things from your friends and family you know when it comes to human rights when it comes to sexual orientation sexual preference when it comes to religion when it comes to politics when it comes to what's on your plate i've had some heated discussions about veganism with my family all i can say is surround yourself with positivity to the best of your ability and if you can't find that love and that compassion and that empathy from your immediate family and friends, then find your tribe. It's so important to feed your soul with like-minded people and they're out there. They're out there. So find some groups, 
do whatever it is that you're passionate about and you're going to attract people who are also passionate about those things. Be happy, be free. Love is love. Love whomever you want to love. <laughs> Enjoy your life because life is so short. Please take care of yourselves, take care of your loved ones, and I'll see you in the next video. Happy Pride Month, peeps. Mwah. <laughs>